a diaper genie windbag. So, Reza, what are we going to need for the experiment? So, what we're going to need is a pair of scissors and we're going to need a long plastic bag. Just like this one, right here. So, I got this plastic bag from a Diaper Genie refill pack. And um, you just have to cut it out, or cut out about 8 feet from the um, pack with scissors. So now what we're going to do is we're going to get the, um, the long plastic bag and we're going to tie like a knot right here at the end. It's a normal knot. So just after we tie the knot, we're going to slide our hand over the plastic bag and take out all the air. So perfect. Now you're going to want someone to hold your knotted up end of the plastic bag. And you want to hold the other. Now what we're going to do is we're going to roll up this end of the plastic bag. Just like this. And now you're going to hold this 8 inches apart from your face. And we're going to blow into a big deep breath. And... This is how it's going to look like. This simple experiment demonstrates Bernoulli's principle. Bernoulli's principle states that as air moves around an object, it creates different pressures on that object. Faster air means less pressure. Slower air means more pressure. So what happens is, when you blow air past your lips, a pocket of lower air pressure forms in front of your face. The stronger you blow, the lower the air pressure pocket. The air around this lower pressure region is now at a higher pressure than the surrounding air, which causes things to shift and move. When you blow air into the bag, keeping the bag a few inches from your face, you build a lower pressure area at the mouth of the bag, and the surrounding air rushes forward and into the bag. I I hope you have fun doing this experiment with the diaper genie bag. Bye.